hymns and melodies wandering the wind, wafting to pastures beyond their home. Two greedy fishies struggling to swim. They ate so much that they're starting to groan. Animal crystal fly draped in gold robes, a bright little light from that glaze lantern glows. Benches pinch the rice and scoot while the boars of the forest anxiously root. Welcome one and all to this festival of poetry, jointly organized by Lua and Mondstadt. Or in full, the neighboring nation's congenial poetry gala. We're your hosts, Liyue's verse monger of the darkest alleys, Hu Tao. And Mondstadt's liquor-loving lyricist, Venti the Bard. The purpose of this event is to promote friendly poetic exchanges between our two nations. So please, have fun, talk to other people, and make some new friends. If you're here, you're our guest. So please enjoy this poetry fest. I'd also like to reassure everyone that this event welcomes people of all skill levels, from first-time rhymers to seasoned songwriters. If you ask me, the most important thing you can bring to writing poetry is authenticity. That means reaching deep down to all the thoughts and feelings you usually hide away or struggle to express and putting them into words. Just write from the heart in whatever form you like. To help everyone really cut loose and enjoy themselves to the fullest, Venti and I have carefully prepared a three themes to be revealed over the course of three days. Let's get right to it. The first theme is Riddle Me This. Solving riddles, huh? Interesting. It's actually a pretty good choice for a warm-up activity. Whew. I'm glad they're not making us write sonnets or something right at the start. Does everyone see the lanterns hanging around the venue? These have been specially prepared for the riddle game. Simply write down your riddle and hang it on a lantern. Then Venti and I will select a few to pose to the crowd, and you will try to solve them. We'll now give you some time to write down and hang up your riddles. Feel free to walk around and talk with the other contestants to get the creative juices flowing. And remember, whoever guesses the most riddles correctly will get a prize. And with that, the neighboring nation's congenial poetry gala has officially begun. Joel Adeptus Chow in the end. He said he'd take a peek from the peaks, but that was all he'd agree to. It's a real shame. I had the perfect poem for his entrance and everything. <laughs> that was a good little opening ceremony, wasn't it? Even if I do say so myself. 